Well, welcome back everyone. Once again, here in Nashville, we're at Fiber Connect and we're going through the, all the buzz and all the key messages and launches. And I'm very excited to speak to Rob Lemann, Senior Vice President at Amdocs. Rob, thanks for taking the time to talk about it. Hey. My pleasure. Well, let's start uh, in general terms, talk about the market a little bit. You'll be talking to a lot of folks here. Where do you see things headed? What are some of the key um, themes you're hearing? Well, I think fiber as a legacy technology is kind of having a rebirth new day in the sun, so to speak. I mean, I've, I worked on fiber 25 years ago in my military experience, seeing it scale out across the industry it has today. It's really a vastly different ecosystem than what it was in the last several decades. A lot of new investment coming in, customer uh, understanding of the value of fiber, the, the power of the speed, the latency it provides uh, that reduces out of the network. Um, it's really a new technology in a lot of ways in the way it's being used. What customers are starting to demand is, is the same things that we're starting to provide for our operator customers. Very fast speed to market, uh, very low latency and, and high bandwidth, uh, getting their customers and the operators their revenue as fast as possible by ultra fast deployments and finding out where we can increase the ecosystem and make it more efficient. Um, that as well as uh, increasing revenue to the operators uh, in, their, in their desire to move forward in the industry is becoming really a relevant pillar for us, essentially, within the ecosystem. Yeah. So tell me a little bit about how Fibercoast can take advantage of this. How does it look like for them, and, and what are the benefits? Well, I mean, any, any fiber code that comes in right now and wants to reach their customers as soon as possible needs to worry about three things. They're going to need to worry about how fast can they deploy their fiber, how good of quality can they bring into that customer to make sure there's no repeats or no design issues, and then finally, um, how they can control their own costs. And so what we're doing at Amdocs, we're providing uh, over-the-top fiber design services on top of our basic systems of record that we already deploy today, our OSS, our BSS, our consulting services, and even our operations and management. Uh, my division runs most of the fiber design engineering for Amdocs. We do a ton of work with tier one and tier two carriers, and the constant need is for high quality, low cost, very easily repeatable and scalable business back to their customers. Got it. Now, we have the branding here, Fiber One. This is a relatively new product line for you guys. Tell me about it. Yeah, we, we launched it out at MWC in Barcelona, and naturally, with everything going on there, it didn't get a lot of attention because there's so much noise inside of, inside of Barcelona. Um, this is more of our hard product launch. What Fiber One represents is Amdocs place in the ecosystem that takes all the things that Amdocs is really well known for. It's award-winning BSS, uh, on, a, on a software as a service cloud native platform called ConnectX. It takes its OSS capabilities, it takes its front end strategic consulting capabilities, as well as field services like design and finally field operations, and basically puts them in one platform. And so think of it from a greenfield operation standpoint. If a new ISP wants to come in and launch quickly, we can put everything in one service and say, here's your all in one box ecosystem skill set we launch soup to nuts. In a brownfield environment, if they've already got a tech stack defined and they want to say change out one part of their system that they're not comfortable with or having some performance problems with, Amdocs again can reach into their catalog of opportunities and, and capabilities and develop that specifically for that operator and fill in where the gaps are at. And finally, if, if a company already has a tech stack lined up, a, a tier one telco that's been doing fiber for decades, we can come in with a services play over the top and give them High quality, low cost from an offshore standpoint, serious development on fiber design services, or we front end consulting and help them see what's out there in the marketplace today and how could you improve your existing systems. Got it. So to close here, let's talk about it practically in terms of your fiber engineering solution. How do you guys support these fiber rollouts? Um, yeah, when it comes to the engineering and-, and Yeah, it's, and um, it's an amazing machine that we've built. So Amdocs has somewhere close to any given day between 800 to 1,000 resources offshore in India. Um, the manager over there, one of the best managers I've ever worked for, extremely well structured and operationally minded. He has this machine moving where we bring in designs from our customer, our, uh, our high level designs that we field out, and then bring them back in and through partnerships with IQGO, NVIDIA, we try to automate and bring as much AI to the table as possible and really accelerate that design and deployment. So we can feed that. And right now, I think we're doing close to 2 million CLs a year, customer locations a year, based on our current demand. And we see the market growing for the next three to five years. You know, most big telcos are looking to expand quite a bit. 
And they're going to lean into companies like Amdocs and provide that, that heavy scalable service at that high quality and low cost. And it's a very easy service to provide when it's, when it's that kind of quality product. Excellent. Well, Rod, thanks for taking the time to talk to us here on yeah, Clear's pleasure. Network. And I can't wait to see the success that uh, Fiverr One and Amdocs brings. Thank you. Appreciate it. Good to see you. Good to see you.